the Perth Theatre Company is preparing for its last show at the Playhouse Theatre before the historic building comes down next year. But the company won't be without a home. It will move to the new State Theatre Centre in Northbridge. Entire training of a policeman is to focus on... It's no coincidence that actors at the Perth Theatre Company are rehearsing The Removalists. The show is their last before they pack up and bid farewell to the Playhouse Theatre. We can't handle anything big because there's only two of us. We can handle anything small, but then again, if it's small, it's hardly worth the effort. We love the Playhouse for all of its faults and for all of its stylish use of concrete and bricks and bad wood and uh, no, it's, it's, it's nice having a, a theatre like this but I think it's, uh, unfortunately it's time has come. The Playhouse was opened in 1956 and was home to the National and Playhouse Theatre Companies before PTC moved in in 1995. While leased by the government, the theatre has always been owned by the Anglican Church and now it wants the space back. Most of the fixtures here in the Playhouse will be saved. Everything from the lights to the sound equipment can be used in other theatres around Perth. The building itself is likely to be demolished early next year. But as one Perth theatre disappears, another is nearing completion. Construction of the State Theatre Centre is on track to finish in December and PTC will be one of two resident companies at the Northbridge venue. Hopefully it will bring Perth back to that kind of age where people are more interested in going to see theatre because the venue, I think, will match their expectations. It provides a world-class performance space, which Perth has really needed for about 30 years or so. The Playhouse has served us well for 50 years but its use-by-date it really has well and truly arrived. The new theatre is expected to open its doors early next year, just in time for the Perth International Arts Festival. Claire Nichols, ABC News.